So several months ago, Bitwit Kyle modded his Node 202 to fit a Corsair H55, I believe. He started with a, Yam a Zalman cooler, uh, and that didn't work out. Anyway, he, he did this, and it was able to fit because he had a R9 Nano in there, a small card that allowed for space to put on a, the fan on the radiator itself. So that all, that all worked out. What I wanted to know was whether I would be able to do that with my EVGA 1070 with the blower cooler on it. Now that is, um, it, the blower cooler, the logger card is taking up quite a bit more space and so the issue I'm having or the, the larger question that, that presents itself is whether I will be able to cool the CPU using the blower fan on the end of the card because that would be positioned right over the radiator on the CPU, uh, the Corsair H60 which I'll be using. So um, I've actually already done it so watch me doing it, do the time lapse thing, and then I will come back to you with the results. So, let's get right to it. It works, but it's freaking loud. It sounds like a jet engine. I have to have the fans at 60-70% to keep the CPU under 90. So, I do not recommend this whatsoever. If you're going to be doing any kind of water cooling inside a mini ITX case, make sure you do it the right way. So, make sure it either supports it or you have the right size other components to allow for it because with a large card and a water cooler inside a case like this one it just doesn't work plain and simple all right you guys know how it works if you liked it like the video if you disliked it dislike the video if you want to see more stuff from me or from Zach or from Caleb I don't know how any of that's gonna work out but if you want to see more you know subscribe you, you know how it works you're all adults or free-thinking human beings so um, I have another video or two or three or four in the works uh, for this desk actually I, I built it by hand no saws yes I use saws I used several electric saws 
uh, but I still kind of built it by hand. Uh, I've got a couple on that, and then a couple more. We're going to be building Zach's first system. It's going to be really nice. We'll be doing a lot of painting and modding, and it's going to it's going to look really really nice. We're waiting for Ryzen to drop though, so uh, once that comes out, we'll be able to pick up a CPU and a motherboard for him. It's going to be really cool, really really cool. Not even joking. Take me seriously on this. His build is going to be super cool. I've talked enough. This outro is getting really really long. So I will leave you with that. Have a nice day.